Over the past weekend, I had the privilege to sit down with a close to final build of Far Cry 5 and give it a go. Yes, it has a crazy protagonist and once you're dead, me. Yes, it has a stunning open world that's probably the best looking one to date, and yes, there are hella explosions. But the main attraction to the game right now is Cheeseburger. And I'm not talking about the quarter pounder from McDonald's around the corner to you, I'm talking about the diabetic grizzly bear that you can partner with throughout Far Cry 5 named Cheeseburger. He is as cute as he is ferocious and I fell in love with him. Cheeseburger is obtained in a relatively early mission in the game where you have to go and kick some cult's ass out of the zoo where the cuddly bear lived. After further inspection, you realize that he's actually not there. You see, the cult has been trying to catch up to turn him against the good guys of the game. Thankfully, you get to him first, but he will not bow to anyone. Rather, as cute bears do, they need food. This mission then saw me head to the local stream to catch a salmon. It was a great way to teach me how to fish, and fishing is a pretty great side activity in the game, which is as calming as it is in real life. Hey, good catch! Different fishing rods will make the experience easier and I can imagine trying to bait in some real nasty looking fish later on in the game. Once I had my salmon, which was a pretty small one only weighing 13 pounds, I had my ticket to Cheeseburger's heart. Cheeseburger was sleeping just a few miles from where I was fishing, so I hopped on a quad bike and set path for his cute little cuddly face. Upon arrival, I found him sleeping near a lake after walking through some dead bodies. These bodies scattered around the area was already a sign that this was no ordinary bear that I was dealing with. He was an absolute killing machine. Like myself, it just takes a little bit of food to turn me onto your side. And Cheeseburger was now a companion after feeding him my small salmon that I caught. Of course, before we could leave the area, the cultists caught wind of my intrusion and came to ruin the day. Little did they know, Cheeseburger was now my bodyguard and he was not going to let anyone hurt me. As we already said, Cheeseburger is a killing machine and what I love about him is just the way he pulls down his prey, which in this case are human cultists, and rips them apart. I could have gone with Jess Black, who's a bow and arrow stealth companion that kills from a distance, but Cheeseburger was just the perfect companion for me. In later missions, I simply aimed my curse at the enemy and instructed him to go for the kill. He's much faster than you think, which allows him to get in, kill and get out before the other enemy spot him. He also has a buttload of health which makes him a nice bullet sponge, but don't let him walk too close to the fire as he burns quite quickly. God damn! I heard you found Cheeseburger! As long as he's with you, I know he's safe. I spent much of my time with a pink flamethrower called Priscilla and often Cheeseburger would get caught up in the fire and die. Luckily a quick revive was all it took to get him back on his feet. Talking about fire though, the cultists really don't play around with it. If you burn one, they actually run into you like some kamikaze freaks of nature and try to set you on fire too. It's, uh, it's pretty awesome. With a load of them shooting at you and you burning at the same time, it could definitely result in some swift death, so be warned. Then again, Cheeseburger, the greatest diabetic bear in the entire world, would come revive you if you died anyway, so it's not really a big deal. A simple lick on the face will bring you back to life. I would totally come back to life if a cute bear gave me a sloppy lick on the face, it's, it seems pretty cool. Talking about being licked, you can also pet Cheeseburger at any time, which is the cutest thing you'll ever see in your entire life, guaranteed. While Far Cry 5 has Boomer the Mangy Dog and Peaches the Mountain Lion, which are also available as companions, I can pretty much see myself using Cheeseburger the entire time when the game releases. He is a killer without a doubt, but his ability to sneak into areas, pull a guy down, kill him and get out undetected is a big deal for me, as I'll probably play most of the game with a bow and arrow, and of course Priscilla, my trusty pink flamethrower. <laughs> Sniper, stay cover. Stay 
tuned for more Far Cry 5 this week as we have loads of content to share from this past weekend's preview event. Who do you think you'll partner up with in Far Cry 5? Let us know in the comments below. But thank you so much for watching guys, be sure to check out our other Far Cry 5 videos on the channel and subscribe for more South African gaming content.